Okay, we're just going to take a quick look through the race ratings for Bathurst on Tuesday. Uh, covered a total of three races at this stage. The first one we're going to look at is Bathurst Race 2. Um, just going to have a look through and identify where the value is early in the betting and um, see if we can find a couple of value betting angles straight off. Okay, Bathurst Race 2, as I said, first race we're going to look at. Um, the top rated here is the number five, uh, which is excited. We've got it rated at 3.10. Um, five excited goes around at $4. Uh, it's pretty good value, good overs. $4, about a 3.10 chance. The second top rated is the two, Don Pedro, which is actually favourite with sports bet at 2.50, occupying 40% of the market. Um, we've got it rated at 4.40. So realistically, at the end of the day, um, that's about 22 23% of the market compared to occupying 40% of the market with um, bookmakers, definite unders, and that's where the value is created, about excited being at $4, rated as a 3.10 chance. The third top rated is the one half crown. It's rated at $5. Um, it goes around as a 4.60 chance, slight unders. And then the fourth top rated is the number four spells, which is rated 6.70. And it goes around as a 9.50 chance. So th those four are clear of um, the rest of them. At 6.70 spells, the fourth top rated. Next is the six at 17.60. So there's about a 10.9 10 drift out to the six. So the four realistic winning chances are the top rated five, uh, second top rated the two, third top rated the one, and the fourth top rated the four. But from a betting perspective, the top rated being the five excited goes around at four dollars on a quote of 3.10 or on a rated price of 3.10 uh, so that'd be the betting angle um pretty keen on that horse actually on initial viewing um from the bjorn baker yard represents good overs has been 4.4 into 4.0 so far so we expect that money to continue come to come um and probably get closer in betting to the stable mate don pedro which does look slight unders uh, bjorn baker looks to have a stranglehold on the race the four, um, probably worth a very minor nibble in support of the top left, even though it's fourth top rated. It is over. It's been bet, uh, bet, rated at 6.7. They're going to bet 9.5 about it. Um, so that's Bathurst Race 2, decent quality betting race. Uh, Bathurst Race 3 is next. Uh, it's, it's worth noting that this is a heat of the Rising Stars series, so it's Apprentice Jockeys. Number 8, Sky Lover, and number 10, Confined Thoughts. Both, ha both have no jockey booked at this stage of the race, so their ratings might change slightly with once jockeys are booked if they are claiming apprentices, um, which is going to be likely. Okay, equal top-rated runners here, the number two and the number five. The two, uh, what about Scotty, rated at 4.6, goes around at 7.0, and the five, Heavenly Prophet, Rated at 4.6 as well, goes around at 5.5. So the equal top rated contenders, both at 4.60, um, go around at 7.0 and 5.5. Um, minor overs are two and minor overs are five. So realistically, in the actual betting market, they're occupying 14 and 18% of the market, combined about 32% of the market. So you're getting combined odds of about 3.10 by backing both of them to get an even profit out of the race, uh, which is pretty decent value. The third top rated is the three, Rupert Sun. It's minor overs as well at 6.0. Um, and the fourth top rated is the six, Own the Night, 6.50. And we've got it rated 8.0, slide unders. And then we get out to the four, five feet apart, rated 11.6, goes around at $10. And it's also worth noting that our six top rated runner, which is the number one packer, and this is where the value is created in the race because it's big unders. It's rated 12.2 and it goes around at 2.80. So um, as per the computer ratings are saying it's a false favourite and a pretty considerable false favourite too. So from a betting angle in this race, um, I'll be looking at backing the two top rated runners being the two at 4.60 and the five at 4.60. They go around at 7.0 for what about Scotty, the two and the five heavenly profit at 5.5. As I said, they... Occupy combined 32% of the market at 7.0 and 5.5. 100 divided by 7 is about 14. 100 divided by 5.5 is about 18.18. So 14, 18, 32% of the market. Um, now, Bathurst Race 7 is the last race we're going to look at for the ratings at Bathurst. 
once it comes up. Okay, Bathurst race seven. The top rated contender here is the number one. We've got it rated at 2.80, which is the four runner. Goes around at 1.60. Um, definite unders, big unders. But the thing here is it is top rated runner. And being unders, it creates a query about this being a strong confidence betting race. So whatever we are going to back here, we're only going to nibble at it to overturn the odds on favourite. The second top rated is the two, which is Systrom, rated at 3.60 goes around at 7.5, that's good overs, about the second top rated. Um, 2.05, the place looks excellent value. These two top rated runners, the one and the two at 2.8 and 3.6, are well clear of the rest. We're gonna go out to the six, which is the third top rated at 8.20, which is um, double plus $1 on the second top rated 3.6. Two lots of 3.6 is 7.2 plus another $1 out to 8.2. So the one and the two are well clear of the third top rated runner, um, which is the six. Uh, and the six is Leon at 15.0. It's still overs. Once again, the overs is created in this market by the four runner being so short at 1.60. At the 1.60, it occupies about 67% of the betting market, while at two point, a rated price of 2.80, we're saying it should occupy about 37% of the betting market. So 67% to 37%, that's a difference of about 30% where the value is created amongst these other runners. So from a betting angle, the two, second top rated 3.6, back at each way, not with strong confidence because the top rated is still the one, but it is unders at the 1.6. We're gonna get 7.5, 2.05, about the second top rated. Um, the third top rated, the six, Goes around at 15.0. It's also overs at 8.2. Very minor nibble. And then the three is rated at 9.7. And it goes around at 15.0 as well. You'll see War Deck is still in the race at 35.0 and 6 to 5. And it's not in the ratings because it goes from 3 to 6. War Deck will actually be a scratching because it's engaged to race at Goulburn on Monday with a jockey book. So as you can see, there's no jockey booked at Bathurst on Tuesday. So that's the three races for covered for Bathurst um, on Tuesday. Um, good luck. Happy